And the festivities officially will begin with a kickoff party on the lawn of the Tennessee Williams Welcome Center, which is where we find our Victoria Bailey. She is joining us now live for a preview of all the pilgrimage festivities. That's right, Andrea. Happening right now is the official kickoff party to the 2018 Columbus Spring Pilgrimage. And as you can see behind me, people are starting to line up for the good food, fun, and good music. But none of this would be possible without the dedication of volunteers. It's all hands on deck when it comes to this week. <laughs> Columbus Junior Auxiliary Assistant Chair Alicia Truesdales talking about the Spring Pilgrimage 68th Annual Charity Ball. We have entertainment this year. We have the Columbus High School varsity singers coming to perform. Um, great group that that we have, and obviously we want to support the local high schools and their what their effort is. Um, and then we obviously present the King and Queen and our royalty court. Uh, and then we have a band. We en enjoy, so we get to sit back and just enjoy just to see what has come together and all the efforts of our charity ball chairman, who is Danette Starks, this year. An effort indeed. More than 800 visitors are expected to be at the Evening of Elegance, meaning the ladies of JA spent months getting ready. We have close to around 80 ladies who are spend about six years in this organization, um, and it's this is on top of everything else that they do. Truesdale says it takes many boots on the ground to get an event this size up and running. It's also the JA's one fundraiser of the year. We are so thankful for corporate sponsors. Um, we are so thankful for local businesses to continue to support us, um, who not only buy an ad but then they come and buy a ticket as well to come to charity ball so it's definitely we're very thankful for them the spring pilgrimage as a whole is powered by the kindness of others columbus visitors bureau ceo nancy carpenter says it brings people together and it shows the true meaning of the friendly city we do depend on volunteers we depend on family members we are all in this together and whether it's picking up you know some garbage or uh making sure that the tables are set. The Garden Club, Northwood Garden Club, did all the beautiful arrangements that are on the tables. So we're appreciative of everyone's hard work. Truesdale says the charity ball is a party with a purpose that started way back in 1951. It's what drives, it's what funds all of our programs, allowing us to go into the schools and to, to make a difference. Um, we're so passionate about our children of Lowndes County because this is our future. So as you can see, the spring pilgrimage requires a lending hand from everyone. Now things wrap up here around 8, so there's still time to come out and join in the fun. We're live in Columbus. I'm Victoria Bailey, WCBI News. Andrea?